flight school. My name is Jackson, with a J. We're gonna start with a basic takeoff. Hold the throttle all the way down to pick up speed, and pull back on the stick to take off. You can retract your landing gear once you're a safe distance above the ground. Congratulations, pilot! You are now airborne! Now, navigate through those checkpoints marked on your radar, and we can move on to the next lesson. That was a good start! Well done! attempt a safe landing on the runway. You won't have many chances to get this wrong, so please, follow my instructions very closely. Executed like a pro! Now let's get the plane off the runway. Taxi over to the marked area and come to a complete stop. That was an excellent landing! Very well done! You're going to be performing a couple of different stunts. We'll start you out with a few barrel rolls. And if that goes well, you can take a crack at flying upside down. and 
help you build your stick and rudder skills. You have to keep your plane steady while rolled over on either side. Perfecting this trick will really come in handy in the later lessons. obstacle course is designed to teach you how to get better control over your turns. The course goes around the harbor and you have to stay low to make the checkpoint. You'll need to use... I want you to use everything you've learned so far to navigate this course as fast as you can. Watch your altitude though. This is really a test of how low you can go and how well you can maneuver the plane.
lesson, I'm going to teach you how to perform an emergency landing. Remember to begin decelerating while you are still airborne for a Okay, do you see your checkpoint marked on the radar? You're going to practice an emergency landing on that bridge straight ahead. Slow your approach as you descend onto the road. If you touch down smoothly, your plane is going to stop pretty fast. That was an excellent landing! Very well done! loop can be a little disorienting, so we'll see how you do under pressure. Make sure you start this stunt from a completely level position. It's also important to remember to pull your stick back as straight as you can so you don't get thrown into a... Take off and head for the marker at the end of the runway. Some pilots find these moves particularly tricky, so it might take you a few tries. Always make sure your plane is straightened out before you attempt an inside loop. On my mark, pull back hard on the flight stick and hold it. Okay, perform an inside loop. Get ready to level out the plane when you're near the end of the loop. That wasn't too bad for a rookie. Let's try it again, just like before. Steady the plane first, wait for my signal, and then pull back hard on the flight stick. Okay, perform an inside loop. Get ready to level out the plane when you're near the end of the loop. Now we're talking! You're doing good so far. I think we can squeeze in one more stunt. We'll combine the inside loop with the barrel roll to perform a roll off the top. Start with an inside loop, but only go halfway. When you're fully inverted, then roll the plane over. Now, when I give you the go-ahead, yank the flight stick back as hard as you can. Ready? Perform a roll off the top. Now, roll the plane right side up. Right there. Level out and retry the stunt from the beginning. That wasn't quite there. Level out and retry the stunt from the beginning. right side up. Ready? Perform a roll off the top. That wasn't quite there. Level out and retry the stunt from the beginning. right side up. and head for the marker at
at the end of the runway. Some pilots find these moves particularly tricky, so it might take you a few tries. Always make sure your plane is straightened out before you attempt an inside loop. On my mark, pull back hard on the flight stick and hold it. Okay, perform an inside loop. Get ready to level out the plane when you're near the end of the loop. That wasn't too bad for a rookie. Let's try it again. Just like before, steady the plane first, wait for my signal, and then pull back hard on the flight stick. Okay, perform an inside loop. Get ready to level out the plane when you're near the end of the loop. Now we're talking. You're doing good so far. I think we can squeeze in one more stunt. We'll combine the inside loop with the barrel roll to perform a roll off the top. Start with an inside loop, but only go halfway. When you're fully inverted, then roll the plane over. Now, when I give you the go-ahead, yank the flight stick back as hard as you can. Ready? Perform a roll off the top. That wasn't quite there. Level out and retry the stunt from the beginning. Now roll the plane right side up. but passable.
taught you how to fly a helicopter. Now you're gonna learn how to jump out of one. Aim for the landing target and pull your chute when you get close to the ground. The parachute is difficult to control, so slow your approach and give yourself extra time to correct. Hope you aren't afraid of heights. Aim for the target and deploy your parachute when you start getting close to the ground. Hope you aren't afraid of heights!
pleased with that. That was pretty close. onto a moving target. So I hope you brought a change of underwear. <laughs> the target will be circling around the runway, so watch it carefully and pay attention to the route. It may take several tries, but once you get this down, you'll be terrorizing drivers all over Los Santos. The drop zone is on the back of a moving truck. So take your time maneuvering with your parachute. It's better to pull your chute early than late. It will give you more time to track the target and try to match its speed. Blue, so you're gonna have to fly through it upside down. 
looking great out there.